Hello, my name is Sean Leviashvili, and I wrote a script called Minor Adjustments, which I am so proud to say is a finalist in this pitch fest. Thank you, thank you, thank you. To tell you a bit about it, this was the script I never wanted to write, but the story I absolutely had to tell. Why? It discusses a setback I never thought I'd encounter, but one that I learned I would survive. Let me explain. To begin, I was diagnosed with cerebral palsy at age two. For those of you who don't know, cerebral palsy is a neuromuscular condition that affects a person's mobility and coordination. I had to go through years of physical therapy, multiple surgeries, and it resulted in me walking with a limp. It always made me feel different. As if that weren't challenging enough, I learned that I was gay around the time I was 12. I mean, I always kind of knew, but by 12, you really know. As a gay man with a disability, I knew I would have challenges, but I also knew I would have a story to tell a very special one. Turns out I was right. As I was writing my own story and putting together scripts to shop out, I learned that Netflix had a show in development with the same exact premise. Young man with cerebral palsy navigates the gay dating scene. It's called special. When I learned about this, I was completely floored. I didn't know what to do, but I knew I still wanted to, no, I still needed to share my story which led me to an even more important script, Minor Adjustments. Minor Adjustments is a deeply personal story to me that is all about surviving setbacks and the importance of support and friendship. It's about two New Yorkers trying to make it in LA, one writer and performer, based off of myself, who discovers that the story he's dying to share, the story he feels he was born to tell, is already in development, and how his best friend, Rebecca, an up-and-coming talent manager, works to support him and mitigate the process. It's all about the wrenches that get thrown in our path and the creative ways that we can walk around them. It's a story that I know will resonate with anyone who's ever had to fight for a dream or to share their voice. And I hope you love it and I hope you see its potential. I can't wait to work with you.